Our next speaker is Theon Hill. He's also a PhD student in the College of Liberal Arts, and his talk is entitled The Exodus and American Culture. Theon? On April 3rd, 1968, one night before his assassination, Martin Luther King Jr. sought to inspire African Americans with the belief that eventually the dream of freedom would be realized in America. He said, I just want to do God's will. And he's allowed me to go up to the mountain. And I've looked over. And I've seen the promised land. I may not get there with you, but I want you to know tonight that we as a people will get to the promised land. My research studies how people use ancient stories through communication to make sense of the contemporary world. King's speech, with its references to the mountaintop and the promised land, draws heavily on the biblical story of the Exodus. That is, the story of Moses and the children of Israel leaving bondage in Egypt to the promised land of Canaan. My research reveals that the Exodus is the most influential and most pervasive story within American culture. For example, when the architects of our nation were designing the American seal, Thomas Jefferson, Benjamin Franklin, and John Adams all wanted Moses' picture on the American seal because they felt that the Exodus most clearly reflected the values on which America was based. When the French wanted to honor America's democratic experiment, they designed the Statue of Liberty to reflect Moses receiving the Ten Commandments from God, thus the tablets in the statue's left arm, because they felt that the Exodus story most clearly reflected the values of America's experiment with democracy. When two Jewish comic writers were seeking to design a character to inspire Jewish pride in the days leading up to World War II, they modeled the Superman comics off this guy named Moses. And as a result, who do we see Superman fighting in the first couple comics? The Nazis. From African slaves being liberated, to searches for renewable energy, to the political speeches of Ronald Reagan, Barack Obama, and John F. Kennedy, the Exodus has played a fundamental role in a wide variety of contexts in America. My research argues that we use ancient stories like the Exodus to understand who we are, who others are, and where we're going. American uses of the Exodus reveal this. We understand ourselves to be a nation headed toward the promised land of freedom, justice, and equality. But we haven't quite gotten there yet.